Hey guys, it's Angel here today, and I'm trying to get organized, and right now I am organizing Silver Proof Eagles. And when I started organizing them, I got a little bit squirreled, because Keith was like, hey, you need to make sure what mint marks they are, and I was like, oh crap. So now I gotta figure that out. Hey, did you figure out the mint marks? No, get out of here! Or maybe I did. But it's none ya. What I learned anyways. Alright. So what I've learned is from 1986 to 1992. They were minted at the San Francisco Treat. San Francisco Mint. So here's 86. And as you can see right here is the S. The mint mark. The 92, so 86 to 92, and they and they had S mint marks on them. And then they switched over from 93 to 2000 to Philadelphia. And I don't know if you can see, like, the color of the boxes, but obviously when they switched over the mint mark, but they had to get rid of the rest of the purple boxes. So 93, they switched over to the Philadelphia mint, so there's the P on that one. And they kept, and they got the, the purple. They stayed purple because they had to get rid of the rest of the purple boxes. And then, what's this? See, so the 2000, it's the P mint mark for Philadelphia. And then 2001 to 2008, they decided to switch over and um, start minting them at the West Point Mint. So there's the 2001. And there's the W, West Point. And then we go to 2008. With the W on West Point. So people started, started collecting these, you know, back in 1986. I thought, yeah, this is a good gift to give to people, like, annually or whatever. But then, like, from 2008 to 2010, we were going into a little bit of a recession. So the demand from investors for bullion coins as a hedge against inflation, like in 2009, the mint was unable to do the proof or the burnished. So they were only able to do the non-mint marked uncirculated ones because the demand for the uncirculated ones was just like way too high. So 2009... They threw a wrench in your set. There's no, there's, there's no proofs for 2009. So you got a hole in your set. That kind of bites. But the people wanted bullion silver. They didn't want the high price silver. So they were unable to do the, the nice higher price silver. All right. So that brings us no mint mark in 2009 because they didn't make one. And then in 2010... Through 2011, they still did the W mint mark from West Point. But then in 2012, they decided to do a San Francisco, a two-piece San Francisco set. So in 2012, they had a W and an S mint marked proof eagle that they double minted us. They double minted us. All right, so in 2017, they really screwed us up because they started minting both the S and W, which I wasn't aware of that, and maybe you weren't aware of that. So a lot of people probably still have holes in their sets. And then in 2020... Things got real complicated. They had the W, the S, and another W. The W was uh, 75th anniversary with a privy, so you had to get, like, three three of them to complete your set and then in 2021 they screwed us up again because like the first half of the year they only had the w mint mark on the 2021 but then when they switched over they did the w and the s and that is when we went to the cheap packaging so One more clamshell yeah, I don't like. I I I li I didn't like it when they and also I didn't like it when they switched from this because like this that's easy to get out. You just pull that little string. Yeah. But then, I think it's this year. Nope. Where's it at? This year, 
they went to this pop out mechanism and sometimes you cannot get it popped out it's like really hard to get it popped out and then they went to super cheap and you have to pop it out but i just thought i'd share this with you guys i thought maybe if i didn't know maybe you didn't know either so i just thought i'd share this little tidbit with you so i appreciate you guys for watching maybe when you're done or maybe when you're done if you liked it you can give it like a little thumb and if you have something to say about it or you'd be like hey that's cool i didn't know that angel maybe just give us a little comment right down there below me and i'll see you next time Bye-bye.